Well, pretty much every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on the feet. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponents. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yeah. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA. Nice kick. Oh, tags him with the left. So the right hand has been there, now he goes left hand. When you're able to fight from both sides, you become really dangerous. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, he might be out. It's one thing to have length, it's another thing to... Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! Take these big ground and pound strikes. You need to put your posture at the bottom, and if you're the top guy, you gotta get to the finish. Continue to gain posture. He's out! Oh, nice jab. Left hook, right hand. Oh, nice right hand. Lewis's strike attempt there is blocked. Right hand on oh! And just like that, the Great fight... Great recognition of seeing what your opponent was trying to do. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. Oh, big knee! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh! Do you believe it? strikes have landed for Francis Ngannou. Good. Oh, 